Hi, how about today we draw this pulley in front of us? It's having two places, I mean three places for a belt or three belt pulley. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna conceive it because we don't have the dimensions. We're gonna go on new day. <coughs> we go metric, standard, we go millimeters and then go create. Okay. So I can give you a clue since we are conceiving together. So our OD, our outside diameter, need to be 400 millimeters. So I want my axis here for guidance to be longer. So that need to be seven, need to be 700 millimeters. And then there is my second axis. Okay, there we go. These are for guidance. And then I come here. I draw my outside diameter. I draw my second circle my third <clears throat> and my fourth so i want this one here to be 400 millimeters i want that one there to be 240 millimeters i want this one here to be 100 millimeters and i want this one i want to be 60 millimeters so that is done what i do next is i come closer here closer here i draw this line here i drag it i drag it down here come on escape i drag it down here up to the then i want i want it to be tangent to my circle i want to draw the place of the key so i'm the place of the key so i'm gonna draw a rectangle there is my rectangle there is my rectangle there we go now i want from here to v to be four millimeters that need to be four millimeters and i want this one here to be 15 millimeters i want that to be 24 millimeters and i want from here to there to be actually 12 millimeters that is 12 millimeters i go escape then i drag it back there thank you that is done so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just have to trim this because i don't need this anymore so i'm gonna select that one then after selected i delay i click on my keyboard the delete and then after that i go trim i trim this part that part come on just select it and delete easier i trim this part as well that part and this part and that part so that is great okay so then after that what i'm gonna do is I'm going to try to draw these lines here, okay, because I need to draw my slots. So my first, my second, come on, my second, uh, B, my second, escape, then I can draw my third, okay, and then I want from there to here to have an angle of 60 degrees that need to have an angle of 60 degrees and from there to here that have to have an angle of 60 degrees that 60 degrees from here to there that need to be 60 degrees as well so 60 degrees so i get that one i get that one what's happening there I want this one to come back here okay so i get that one i hope that from here to there that does need to be 60 that's 60 and then uh, from here to there that's come on and from there to there that is 60 again from here to there that is 60. okay so i come up there i select slots 
and then I need to give the axis of my slot so it needs to go from here okay from there up to escape I don't need that slot I need this one here that is better so I want from there to there so I want to say from there to here then I want it to go up to there now I need to give dimension so I want from there to here come on I want from there to be 85 millimeters that need to be 85 millimeters so I'm gonna draw my second slot again I start there from there that's 60 yeah? to there again the same way great my third slot from here to it now here escape my third slot there I go. from here to here and then that's the same way great okay so that is done everything is done so what i do now is i'm gonna remove this i select it and then i say delete i remove that i remove that i remove that then i say finish sketch i come here i punch extrude so i want this one here to come up to go with 100 millimeters but both sides both sides i say okay and then i come here i select visibility again i come inside the say extrude oscillate that supports i want it to go by 30 millimeters 30 millimeters and both sides i say okay then this portion I want it to go by 100 millimeters and both sides both sides like that you see that's correct I say okay okay so once that is done okay once that is done I need to give I need to draw the way the ways of my belt so I come up here and then this is what I'm gonna do okay escape it would like this come on okay then I say origin I select my drawing plane why is it and I come up here I select that I want this one to be the way it is zero then I come up here I say drawing and then here I right click on it and then I say slice graphics I slice it okay so now this is how I'm gonna do I'm gonna come up here and then select a rectangle so there is my rectangle and I'm gonna come like this uh, create and then I need to draw an axis for guidance correct I got it and I need to have a line here for guidance as well correct another line here for guidance correct I want this to be parallel to that correct I want from the 
to here to be 50 millimeters 50 millimeters great i get that i get that one that is fine for me now so what is next now is i need to draw this you can see the ways the ways of my pulley so i'm gonna come back here okay then from the what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna try to i'm gonna try to draw my lines okay so i want my first line to start from here up there okay another one let's do this that will be better otherwise we're gonna have confusion escape i need to delete this one we might have confusion so from the to here right then i want the dimension from the up to the let's trim that part let's trim that part i want the dimension now from the to here to be 10 millimeters so that need to be 10 millimeters okay that come here i want the dimension from here to the to be 10 millimeters so that is 10 millimeters i got that one i come here then i draw my other line here's my second line then i want from here to the to be 10 millimeters so that is 10 millimeters okay and again i come up here where is my line i come up here then i draw that line there i want from the to the come on i want from the to the to be 10 millimeters so that need to be 10 millimeters okay that needs to be 10 millimeters and then from here to the come on escape and then from here to the that need to be 20 millimeters okay and then from here to the come on from here to the that need to be 15 millimeters right i got that one correct and i want the angle from here to the that angle need to be 13 millimeters so 13 according to the calculation i got so not to only sorry 11.31 millimeters so great and then from the to the that one there need to be 10 millimeters or well. that need to be 10 millimeters and from here to the that need to be 20 millimeters i got that one correct i come up here then i draw that one great i want from the to the that need to be 10 millimeters and i want from here to the that need to be 10 millimeters great and from here to the that need to be 20 millimeters great so that is done you can see that is done so what i'm gonna do next is in order to avoid any inconvenience i'm gonna delete this line i'm gonna delete it i'm gonna try to lengthen to give some length to that line 
again here yeah, you're gonna understand why again there escape the same apply there there we go come on yes uh -huh. that is not correct so again there great i come up here again up to the escape from here up to the great escape and then from here up to the that is great okay and then i'm gonna have to draw this line so that my line starts from here then to mark it must cut cuts through all of cut through all of this line here cut through all of them that's now nah, it need to be a little bit lower so let's start this side so because this is this is the lowest of all or the shortest so there you go great once i get that one done so i come up here i say trim that spot trim these spots trim that trim that trim that trim that trim this spot trim that spot trim that spot trim that one and then down here i need to trim that I need to trim this, I need to trim that, I need to trim that, I need to... So I need to remain with this porch here. That needs to be solid, 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 void, 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 void. So again, I'm going to delete that spot there. I'm going to delete this spot. I select it, I click delete on my keyboard. That better need to be trimmed, that better be trimmed. So that needs to be trimmed because I need to get that spot there. Then I trim this one as well. Great. Then I go escape, then I delete that one. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do next is I go on 3D model, then I say revolve. Did I say revolve? Yes. Then I select my profile. There is my profile. Then my axis, so I need to go against this axis. What axis is that? It's y axis. I select against y axis, then I go full, fully. Oh, so it's gonna go fully, then I go cut. Okay, this see how it's gonna look okay, like that. Then I say, okay, so here is how your three belts way pulley looks like. Okay, so what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna come up here and uh, remove visibility. Then I need to remove my working plane visibility removed. Okay. So this is beautiful. So look, look how beautiful your pulley looks like. Aren't you proud? Okay. So what we're gonna do now, you're gonna have to select the material. So let this one be if to working on heavy machinery or whatever it is. So let's say our uh, carbon steel, it's gonna have to be heat treated though in order to give it the the strength and all of those things that you, you can imagine when it comes to mechanical uh conception so carbon steel that is fine that is fine that is so fine this is great this is great i like it i hope you also like it so it was a pleasure of mine sharing this video with you i hope you enjoyed it i know you did and i hope that you're gonna subscribe if you haven't subscribed and I also hope that you're gonna share this video, this video because it's a, it's a beautiful one. It's a beautiful one, of course. And for now, I'm gonna ask you to take care of yourself and uh, see you on the next video. Bye.